Welcome to Coach's Corner. We're here today from Coach J.T. Wall with John Millage Academy about the team's upcoming season. Here's Fox Sports 1670's Bill Shanks with more. In the five seasons before J.T. Wall took over as the head coach at John Millage, the Trojans had five straight losing seasons, but the last two years have been a little bit different, 19-5, and five, including a trip to the state semifinals a year ago. J.T. Wall, the head coach of the Trojans, joins us here. You know, uh, that's quite a turnaround, but what did last year and the success you had, you were undefeated up until that last game of the season, what did that mean for this program? Um, I think it meant a lot because that, that group of seniors were, were there, you know, the first year that uh, I came in as an assistant and they had been there four years really working their tails off, you know, in the weight room and on the, on the practice field and they finally started seeing a lot of, a lot of, uh, proof in the pudding, so to speak, after, yeah. after all that hard work. So, Do you feel like after two years, that mindset that had to be a little bit off after five straight losing seasons, does that change? Has you helped change that? I think we've, we've uh, pretty much revived the culture. I mean, yeah. because, you know, we were a, a winning program before, and, and they were for a while. They just had a slump a couple of years. Mm -hmm. And um, I think we're back on track, and the kids have bought in to the program and, and what we're trying to accomplish. That loss in the semifinal still sting it's, a little it bit? It still hurts, man. It yeah, still hurts. I'm uh, sure. It's tough. Yeah, no doubt. Well, your offense last year scored 41 points per game, but only two returning starters. That's yeah. tough, too, isn't uh, it? It's very, very tough. You know, we graduated 18 seniors. Uh, we've got 13 seniors this year. Uh, but the good thing about, you know, only returning two is last year we had a couple of games that were, you know, blowouts with scoring 40 points a game that we were able to get these guys a lot of reps, mm -hmm. you know, not just mm -hmm. two or three reps a game. You know, a lot of times they were playing the whole second half. Mm -hmm. So they have some game time experience, and we feel like we've got some guys that are ready to step up and, and ready to uh, take control, so to speak. Quickly name a couple of your skill players that you're looking forward to seeing this year. Uh, Tommy Pittman will be at tailback. He was our leading tackler last year at linebacker. You know, he's been a, a heck of an athlete. You know, he was a, he anchored our 4 by one state championship relay team. Um, We've got Colby McCommon looking to be the starter at quarterback. He's been there three years. Mm -hmm. uh, Hunt, uh, Hunter Harding will be at fullback. So, you know, we've got some receivers and some tight ends that, that I think will be in the mix as well. All um, right. Well, that's the offense coming up tonight on the late news. We'll talk about the defense. How will the Trojans look in Region 4 AAA? We'll do that and talk more about John Millage tonight. We'll see you then. And tomorrow at 6 here on 41 NBC, Bill Shanks sits down with Coach Brian Way from Warner Robins High School.